why do some games get a remastered port while other awesome old games don't even get anywhere? Hey there, Scott Action Jackson here, and this is an interesting question I kind of brought up across Facebook. Why are there tons of pointless remasters when there are some great hidden gems that are older generation games that haven't even been ported over, let alone given a remaster at all? Case in point, the most recently wonderful 101. Now, it was previously on the Wii U, and it's brought over to the Switch, and I think Steam, as a remastered. Uh, technically, it doesn't need to be remastered, it just needs to be ported over. The fuck you need a remaster for? But then again, there are so many other games that got slapped into a remaster when it was just one previous generation away. Like numerous Assassin's Creed games. Some Call of Duty Modern Warfare games. Dark Souls. The 2013 Tomb Raider game. These all got deluxe remastered collections, and yet there's numerous games that haven't even been touched in so many years. I mean, I especially brought this up with to what I consider my favorites, but some I consider hidden gems, and that's being Wing Commander 3 and Wing Commander 4. Now, these two games came out on PC, 3DO, and PlayStation 1. They both have great stories, have okay controls. I just don't understand why anybody has looked past these or looked over them and just go with something more recent. It confuses me why there's so many older generation games that nobody bothers to take a look at and try to remaster it or remake it. Yet there's always these pointless ones that are getting remasters. Oh, we'll throw a remaster on here. Oh, we'll throw a remaster on here. Oh, it was the last generation. It's already in high definition. Let's throw more high definition on it. It's just bullshit. I mean, I could understand wanting to keep your company name on the title like Disney does with some of these movies like they've been doing with the Lion King and Aladdin just keep it in their rights and I, I kind of wonder if that's the case with some of these ones from just the previous generation of games or if it's just for some reason they see possible dollars in them and not in some other ones it, it just confuses the hell out of me. But yeah, like as I said, I, I, at this point, I don't care if it sounds like I'm a repeating record. If something is just one generation away, it doesn't need a remaster, remake, definitive edition. It just needs to be ported. I mean, you could work on older generation games like a PlayStation 2 game. I don't mind the fact of trying to remaster... Something that's older like PlayStation 2 or original Xbox. But just doing it so close from the previous one? The fuck? I mean, it, it, I wish so many companies would actually go back and remaster or announce an actual remake for some of these older games. Now, I know for some reason, some of these remasters have to take a long-ass time... Probably because of how farther back some of them are to remaster, but for something just one generation right away, it shouldn't take that much or that long to remaster it. Or something like Shadow Colossus takes a while to try and remaster. Some of the more recent Assassin's Creed's not so much. They could use less time 
on something more recent and go back and try and maybe fix some errors or do something, which is probably why they want to remake some games because they're probably too old to remaster. Now go ahead and comment down below if you know of any PC console games that are so old and great that hasn't even been touched upon to get a port over or a remaster. Or give your opinions on why some of these games aren't even being touched when they're great games.